She was beautiful. <laughs> she was. Until that porco defiled her. I wish he'd just killed her. I wish he'd just killed La Mia Mata. People who saw her grow up cheered when he spat on her. Smiles on their faces when her neck... I understand. How can you? My Livia was innocent. I have lost family to the rope. To treachery. Il Carnefice watches from his home on the hill above. He threatens to hang me if I cut her rope. When you are ready, take her down. I will deal with Il Carnefice. Nice horse, man. Uh, not my best. But it's hard to make art with poor materials. Uh, you didn't think this through. Tell me if you need to rest. Don't do it. die. If I let you. Which limb shall I take first, huh? Maybe I will start with that pretty head. I'm just doing my job, right? Please. <laughs> good, good. If I don't, don't die. I'm just doing my job, right? Requiescat in pace. Ezio, what a surprise to see you here. I thought you had sent for me. Never. News of the villa attack has spread across the city. We were certain that you were dead. Not yet. I am still very much alive. The Borgia must not discover that you escaped them. Follow me. Take care not to draw any undue attention. When do I ever?
You would be wise to purchase missing equipment. You will not live long in Roma without supplies. I have my blade. I and the guards have their guns, courtesy of the Borgia. Fortunately, I can help you. Grazie. While you are in my debt, perhaps you will listen to reason. As soon as I hear some, I will let you know. I made the most beastly of broadswords yesterday, fit to terrorize a Turk. My own. Yes. Now you can survive the journey back to Firenze. Perhaps. But I'm not going to Firenze. Oh. There will be no peace until we rise up against the entire Borgia family and the Templars who serve them. I do not recall such brave talk at Monte Regione. How could I have known that they would find me so quickly? That they would kill Mario? Rodrigo surrounds himself with snakes and murders. Even his daughter Lucrezia has been sharpened into one of his most artful weapons. But she pales in comparison to the man behind the villa attack. He is ambitious, ruthless, and cruel beyond imagining. The laws of men mean nothing to him. He murdered his own brother to take power. He knows neither danger nor fatigue. Those who do not fall by his sword clamor to join his ranks. The powerful Orsini and Colonna families have been brought to kneel at his feet. And the King of France stands at his side. Give me his name. Cesare. Head of the Papal Armies. What does he intend to do with his power? What drives the man? That I still do not know. But Ezio, Cesare has set his sights on all of Italia, and at this rate he will have it. Is that admiration I hear in your voice? He knows how to exercise his will. A rare virtue in the world today. This district is run by thieves and incompetent. Should we not travel by horse? Roma is quite large. As Cesare's conquests in Romagna continue to succeed and the Borgia grow in power, they have taken desirable areas of the city for themselves. We cannot use the stables here. Oh, the will of the Borgia is law now? What are you implying, Ezio? Do not play dumb with me, Machiavelli. Do you have some kind of plan? I am improvising.
Just because you kill a few guards does not mean the people will grant access to the stables. You are right. We need to send a signal. Wait here. Seems this table is now available for purchase. After you. The CNS banker Agostino Chigi will host yet another huge festa at his villa in honor of his immense good fortune. In particular, the huge profits expected against loans to the Colonna and Orsini families will be celebrated. You excel at opening wounds, Ezio. But can you also close them? I intend to heal the sickness. Not treat its symptoms. Stop sparring with me. Fine. Let us talk openly then. Rodrigo Borgia... ...as death would not have solved anything. I am inclined to disagree. Look at this city. The center of Borgia and Templar rule. Killing one man will not change the... We need to take away the source of their power. Are you suggesting we appeal to the people? Maybe. Relying on the people is like building on the sand. You are wrong. Our belief in humanity rests at the heart of the Assassin Brotherhood. He must be from your inner circle. Go, get back what he has stolen. I will wait at the Campitolio. I am meeting a contact there. Give me back my money! Come back here! Please, be careful, hey. Mr. You get away to draw You are making a big mistake! Romans! You have problems with the Lord for a regret sparing your life. Oh, 